So for those of you who have PC repair problems or have that blue screen error, uh, if the PC doesn't boot like uh, the one they showed me, so press the power button. So once it starts, press Alt F10, Alt F10 simultaneously. So pressing Alt F10, it will take a while. Okay, so that's where the repair option will be uh, uh, shown. So if you have to exit and continue to use Windows, press continue. But if not, go to troubleshoot and refresh your, or reset your PC or use an advanced tool. So what we shall do for the meantime is choose troubleshoot. And if your PC is running well, you can refresh it without losing your file. So I recommend first using this one. But if you use this and still doesn't, uh, your PC doesn't run well, try to reset your PC. But be careful. It says here that you want, if you will do this, you will remove. You want to remove all your files. Uh, you can reset your PC. It will reset your com PC completely. So all all data will be lost. So if you have a chance to back up your data, back it up now. Um, but uh, this is your last resort. If your computer really doesn't start. So we first go to refresh your PC and then choose the account which is in this case is 7515. In your case it will be SW10 something and enter the password. So we don't have a password so click next, continue. So we wait. So this is a working PC so I think there's no problem here. So your files and person is per, uh, here's what will happen. Your files and personalization will not change. Your PC settings will be changed back to their defaults. Apps in Windows stores will be kept. Apps installed on this uh, web installed from this or websites will be removed. So Survey B will also be removed. Uh, a list of removed apps will be saved on your desktop. So next, and then wait for a few minutes. So the other option is resetting the, the the PC. So so it takes a few minutes. It depends. So after this, I will show you how the uh, resetting the PC will be done.